Welcome back. We're over here discussing uh, one of these romance novels here, and Helene is telling me she's like, "Please don't let, don't make people think these books are all about sex." <laughs> so they're not. Look at look at the cover of this. Here's a naked man, a naked woman. <laughs> they're not. It's about it's about romance. Yeah, it's about relationships. Mm -hmm. All of these books, whether you get one like this, which is a sweet romance or regency, mm -hmm. or you get one like this, which mm -hmm. is very heavily into sensuousness, are about relationships mm -hmm. and how they grow and how they overcome mm -hmm. problems. Mm -hmm. And sex is part of that, mm -hmm. but not all of it. So these books are more on the sensual side as opposed to the sex side. Correct. Mm -hmm. Correct. Mm -hmm. And there can be something very sensual in just a glance. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Or the way somebody touches somebody's hand. Uh -huh. There, are, there are some wonderful things in here. Uh, <laughs> Suzanne's constant cuddling, uh, all, the, all these kind of things. He held her in his arms, and 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 and. Um, this is great stuff. Okay, so those out, those are people out there who are interested in becoming a romance writer. Is there a way that they can contact the Central Florida Romance Writers? That's right. The National Organization has a website. Wow. It's www.rwanational.com. Well, that's and great. they can connect to our uh -huh. our local website uh -huh. from there. Uh -huh. So now, speaking of websites and all this internet and all this computer stuff, what are these ebooks about? Oh, what is that about? Ebooks are brand new. Uh, they came out about three years ago for college students. Uh, a way to the reader is about the size of a normal book, and it's run on batteries, and you can download up to ten textbooks into this. And instead of oh. carrying a whole backpack full <gasps> of books, you can load, you can have wow. these books. Amazing. It's a marvelous, marvelous Amazing. new invention. Amazing. And what's happened now is now fiction writers have gotten uh -huh. into this and said, uh -huh. this is a great thing for people on the move. Absolutely, absolutely. That's going to change things quite a bit, I, th I, think. I think. Well, my, my picture of it is, um, when I moved, I moved like 14 boxes of books. If I have an e-book reader uh -huh. and I have all my books on CDs, I move my library in a shoebox. Wow. And I think that's a wonderful uh -huh. improvement. Uh -huh. So I think that possibly we should have you come on the show with some other ebook authors possibly and things and uh, maybe we'll do that. We'll talk a little bit more about uh, what these ebooks are all about. That would be interesting. So someone could basically... And we'll bring a reader with us so that you can oh. see what it looks like. Oh, wow. Yeah. That would be fascinating. Okay, we'll be doing that soon. Okay, give us some more information. Now, oh, here we go. Here's the Writer's Report ro on Romance. And this is a national magazine, national did we say, and here she is under first sales. Helene Rajeski Edwards announces the sale of her first historical romance, Another Love, to Starlight Writer Publications. That is, that is incredible, incredible. I'm so, I'm so happy for you. So. Um, now, you are a historical writer. Correct. Now, now, I would think that writing a historical romance novel would be very difficult because there's so much research that if you're writing, say, a book on, you know, Gone with the Wind, you have to make sure that all, even down to the description of the clothing that they're wearing, and in those days, the women, you normally wear their hair very long, and, and all these little things that you need to, to no, play. No modern slang. Right, right, yes. the way that they would talk. Uh, give us maybe give us a couple lines or excerpts from uh, your book. Oh, let's see. Gosh, oh, you had to do that to me. That's terrible. <laughs> Lower than a snake's belly in a wagon rut. <gasps> wow. Uh, yes, I mean that's depressed. My goodness, <laughs> My, that's totally different uh, language than, yeah. what, than what it is now. Say, oh, yeah. say as opposed to Jackie Collins. <laughs> oh, the, no. <laughs> I'm very fond of Jackie Collins' books. You're familiar with Jackie Collins? Yes, now, Jack of course. Now, what would you consider Jackie Collins' style to be? She's definitely not a historical book. Well, she's a novelist, uh -huh. and she writes glitzy novels. Uh -huh. And uh -huh. that's not a put-down. Uh -huh. I think she does some great work, uh -huh. you know. But uh -huh. uh, 
it's a very and it's very, another style. So another how many, style. How many styles are there really? Of so, if someone wants to write a romance novel, they probably need to realize what direction that they want to go in. So it's not just finding two people who are trying to make this connection. There has to be the the background to right. it. Well, we have all kinds. So we have sweet romance, which um, usually there's no sex. There may be a hug or a kiss. Oh, really? Okay. okay. See, so this is this. Well, this is, is a regency. Romance. This is a regency, which are considered mm -hmm. sweet because mm -hmm. that time frame uh, of 1812. Wow. You know the four mm -hmm. or five years surrounding mm -hmm. that, mm -hmm. um, was considered very light mm -hmm. and playful era. Mm -hmm. And a lot mm -hmm. of those books are light and playful. Mm -hmm. There's very few that have anything beyond. Are you wondering where all the quality singles are? Singles that are attractive, educated, and financially secure? Hello, I'm Michelle Valentine, and I've helped thousands of singles live a happier life, and I can help you too. Clients and members include millionaires, models, doctors, lawyers, and teachers. So call us for your complimentary consultation. To view more videos, see photo galleries, and more fun stuff, visit the Michelle Valentine TV Show website at www.michellevalentine.tv. Be sure to follow us on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube, and LinkedIn.